Hello. Hello. I'm Zio Spantera, the host of Inner Fetish. And I'm um I'm starting out today's bout of IMs with the King RS from the Fragrant Zither or TFZ. And I haven't done one of theirs in a while, and this has uh been here for a bit. So I look up the price and it's it's way more than I thought it would be for the packaging and everything. It's like 240 bucks. And then I'm trying to read through it while I'm listening to it. It doesn't grab me. This is going to be one of those IMs. It's like, I'm going to tell you to spend $100 instead of $240 because you're going to get so much more variety and just excitement. and what. I... But then I started scrolling down the description and <laughs> all alloy copper material with strong pronunciation unit has soft wheat W-E-E-T, moist and elastic tone. Yes, that's, this is it. This is, that's, that, you couldn't have said it better yourself. Thank you. So it's apparently an 11.4 millimeter double magnet cavity gold diaphragm unit. So it's a single dynamic, and I love single dynamics. That the fact, and it's, it rarely runs in 8 milliwatts, and I had, uh, hold on, my phone's, my phone's freaking out. Give me a second, I can't. That was too good. Uh, why doesn't... I don't have my fucking other fingerprint loaded. Um, yeah. Okay, we'll figure out how to get that to me. And then I gotta mute this, because I told her I was gonna be doing work, and I wasn't doing work. So anyway, this is great, because it's like... Uh... $238, no reviews, it's been here forever. Oh, we picked our wallpaper, we gotta put her into used. Uh, now, right at this moment, as I'm dragging it into the used, uh, Resilio Sync is syncing all the wallpapers I ever use with all the people who follow the wallpaper hoard on Resilio Sync. Anyway, she's a king, right? That's why I picked her. I didn't actually watch any of the Fate series, but I think she's King Arthur, spoiler alerts. Either way, yeah. Um, Fragrant Zither single dynamic comes in a box like is this the box of a 240 dollars i am and then like it comes with just like a plastic case which is like all right it's it's fine that's fine and it comes with some tips which say uh, tfzither.com and there's little foam inserts and there was little foam tips that were on it and you get a little wire clip and it's it's 3.5 millimeter it's not even a balanced end and it's this weird, like, 1970s gold-looking fucking 3.5. We've got a twisted gold and silver. I don't hate the cable. It's relatively straight. Uh, hold on. Let me get another. It, it does have occasional, like, oh, that's a nice sound from an IM. But $240 for these? Um, they don't feel great. They're heavy. They're heavy. They have this weird design on them, which would be fine if you didn't have to touch them, but they occasionally just feel weird in the hand. And they go from, like, a wrapping warp to, like, these lines and ridges. And I guess there's nothing wrong with the actual shape of them. The wire gets a little bit too bendy up here. I'd want to loosen this up a bit. It's also, and I, I pulled this out before and it nearly broke, so let's. I just felt like it was going to break. So it will just take a two-pin two wire right there. But it's got a shield around it, so it's not quite a QDC, but it's not quite a, just a straight-up two-pin. So this this shield actually goes around the the clear block here, and gives it like a uh, more a more stronger uh, hold on the IM. And I'm I'm running the Duno SS tips on it. I was gonna try the. I'm not even energetic enough to try the goddamn render tips on it. It's fine. Like here's the thing. It's fine. It's a fine IM. It does it does exactly what an IM should do. A big sound. But it never, like, I've been listening for, like, fucking 40 minutes. Trying to ignore it. On my phone, talking to people. Just trying to, like, listen to the I Am. And waiting for it to, like, hit me with that song or whatever it does. Almost every decent I Am. You'll be going through and you'll just, you'll track after track after track. And at some point, one will just hit you. And I don't have, like, a, uh, I'm not using a reduced track set here. I got, like, 30,000 tracks. So it's, like, something, please wake up. And it just it just doesn't. Now, all right, I'll I'll find this video is gonna be too short anyway. Let's go switch out to a goddamn render tip. If you want my render tips, linked in the description. 
These are a uh, silicone tip with foam inserts, which usually can give you the... this. These tips, the Duno SS, are great for guaranteeing a snug fit because they're literally a square cylinder. And the render tips, if you can manage to put them on, will sometimes make everything worse and sometimes make everything way better. They certainly trap the low end behind any IM you need to plug into. Currently running off of the uh, new Neo 2 IDSD 2 to part 2. So, I mean, IFI, no bass boost, no anything else, like enhancements on. Aladdin OST. The Kiss. Very wistful, very light. Doing its job. Doing a wistful, light repre representation of this song. It's fine. These are a 7 out of 10, I am. If you own them, you know, you're doing just fine. You paid a little bit too much for what you get and this goddamn packaging, but it's like, it's fine. And there was a pretty big difference, actually, going from the Fio here. What the hell are you? K11. I need to get the review of the K11 done, because the Fio's is pretty good. But difference in sound going from the Fio K11 to the uh, IFI. You know, I'm just, I'm just, I just... Meh, meh, even with the fucking render tips. I didn't do many songs, but it's like, usually that will just like grab you. Nothing. Is this the short? It's going to be the shortest I am review ever. It might be. I'll, I'll link the desk mat. Look, I look, girl playing guitar and desk mat with flat speakers. Completely flat. Uh, Yeah, I'm just going to move on to the next one. I, I got mega S the things over there to, to play with. Maybe that'll change my mind. Although I've heard arguments about the mega EST five whatever's. That they're just very neutral, and that's why DMS loves them, and why I'm going to probably go meh. So we'll find out. We'll see. It used to be you get banned on Face Punch if you predicted moderation. Like, hey, don't do that. You're going to get banned. Got you banned. It's weird. So I think predicting my own judgment will get you banned. Don't don't predict it. Anyway, a wallpaper in the wallpaper hoard. Patreon subscribers to support these. I mean, this is a lack. This is. I have three days. You have to wait two more days now for another IM review. Unless I change the schedule to every other day. Or change the schedule to three times a week and then skip four. I don't know. I might play around with scheduling because YouTube's being a dick. Anyway, enjoy this. Thank you for supporting me. And if you came out to find a great I am, um, it's fine. It's just fine. And I don't have the energy to complain any more than that. I'm going to the next one. Bye.